Hatimaye mazishi ya mwende zake aliyekuwa mbunge wa Kitui Magharibi yamefanyika nyumbani kwake Kabati kaunti ya Kitui. Maelfu ya waombelezaji wakifika kuifariji familia yake huku mjane na wanawe wakikumbuka kwa upendo aliyokuwa nao. He was the kindest, most compassionate person I have ever known. You'll always be a powerful influence in my life. If flowers grow in heaven, Lord please give my dad a bunch and tell him they are from me. Tell him I love him and miss him. To many, Francis was a good politician. To me, he was the best father I would ever ask for. He always protected, provided for and defended me. Speaker wa bunge la kitaifa Justin Muturi naye akiongoza wa bunge kuipa familia pole. Francis and a way of always from his office he would come and he always called me hakuna mambo ya speaker nakuja JB hapa naona tuongee na huyu kiongozi wa walio wengi naona kama anapoteza anapotea nje anapoteza I had a very very nice time working with Francis as leader of minority na alikuwa mtu mzuri sana na tukikutana tulipendana unajua wakati nilikuwa kijana mdogo hata tulikuwa tunaimba ananiambia kawimbo nda kwendile weka na kanini Francis Nyenze was firm was soft spoken and he never feared to give his opinion and when you convince him and you justify he'll always we agree with you we have lost a great leader i come in to succeed Nyenze although i succeeded him before he passed on but how i wished that he lived longer so that he could train me to fit perfectly in his shoes vinara wanasa raila udinga musalia mudavadi na moses wetangula pia walikuwa hapa kwa niaba ya upinzani kuifariji familia huku siasa za mazungumzo zikichacha lakini sasa mimi nataka kuambia nyinyi hapa tulisema sisi tulishinda na sisi tutapishwa Tumeambiwa at your treason at the treason at hiyo ni kifo nataka kujibu jidhu muigai hapa na bosi yako ikiwa kama kifo ndio lazima tufanyike ili tusiwe na wizi wa kura tena tutapishwa na tukufe kama wameapisha mtu ambaye alichipikia kura sisi ko tuko tayari kuapisha aliyepikiwa kura na wakenya na nataka mkumbuke kwamba uchungu ambao tutaweza kuja kwa watu wa Kitui itakuwa ule uchungu ambao nyinyi mtakaa nyumbani alafu baadaye msikie mna kiongozi ambaye ametolewa na kompyuta electoral justice amani bila haki haiwezi kuwekwa lazima muombe tuwe na haki katika inji yetu haki kwa uchaguzi haki kwa kugawa rasilimali haki kwa kila kitu amani hata hatutaiombea itakuweko tu born out of justice viongozi hao wakitaja kifo chake nyenze kama pigo kubwa katika kambi ya upinzani huko utuba ya kinara wa waipa kalonzo msioka ambaye yuko ujerumani ikisomwa na gavana wa makueni kivutha kibwana yeye alikuwa na kwenda na natimiza vile tulikuwa tumekubaliana hii kwa hivyo Francis Nyenze alikuwa ni mkenya mzalendo mkirekete ya ukombozi amekufa kama mbunge umeona vile alienda kujapishwa katika kama mbunge akibeba ile tangi ya hewa hii inaonyesha upendo ambao alikuwa naye na watu wa Kitui West kwa hivyo sisi tunamwomba Mola amweke yeye pale pema peponi the song is ended but the melody lingers may his soul rest in peace Mwenda zake amemwacha mjane na watoto watatu huko viongozi wa kaunti hiyo akimpigia mjane Edith Nyenze kumridhi mumewe katika kipindi kilichosalia 
Hatimaye safari Asha, ya miaka sitini ya mwenda zake aliyekuwa mbunge wa kitui magharibi Francis Nyenze imefikia kikomo katika eneo la Kabati katika kaunti ya Kitui alikozikwa mengi yamesemwa kuhusu mwenda zake lakini la muhimu ni jinsi mwenda zake alivyojitolea kuhakikisha kwamba wenyeji wa eneo bunge hili wamefaidika Steven Letoo kutoka kaunti ya Kitui